Did you know you could convert, view, and adjust embroidery designs on your iPad? Yes, you can. If you want to learn how, keep watching. But first, my intro. Okay, the first thing we need to do is open up Safari and go to wilcom.com. There'll be a link in the description. Tap on products and True Sizer products is what we're looking for. We're going to select the free web one. Now you have to set up an account. I already have one. I don't need to show you my uh, sign in stuff. And all of this is on the iPad. I'm recording it on the iPad. And look, we have embroidery on our iPad. And with the True Sizer, you can open designs that you've saved in something called SkyDrive, which is a Microsoft product. So if you have that, you can store and uh, save your embroidery designs in there. Now there's a lot of things you can do. You can rotate your embroidery designs in different ways. You can mirror them. You can mirror vertical. So you can play around with them quite a bit. You can size up 10%. You can size down 10% and you can also specify the size. I just zoomed in a little bit there. You can see different ways. There's zooming, there's one-to-one. -one. You can uh, center display an inch metric, so different ways of looking at it. I just zoomed out again. You can add a grid. There's quite a few things you can do with it. Now, sorry it's a little bit flashy, but that's what the iPad does. I like the ruler and I like the grid. I like the ruler because it's nice and big and you can see what you're doing. And it also only goes to your the ends of your design. So I thought that was really neat. So specify size, there we go. It, I decided, how about just change it to six? and it automatically constrains it so you're not, you know, stretching it out or, or doing anything like that. Um, and that looks fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I do like the ruler on. That seems to work best for me. So you can uh, undo, redo if you make a mistake or if you just wanted to see something and you didn't like how it looked, that would be how to do it. Simple, easy, and you can see your embroidery designs on your iPad or your Android. Now, I don't have Android to show you guys, but that is how it's done. So then you can convert the design and save it on the Sky Drive. So you can convert it from whatever you brought it into, even an EMB file, if you bring it in, you can uh, convert it to whatever stitch file that you want. You can print out a template with all of the information and those pretty rulers I was telling you about. The colors, the size, how many different colors, the name of the colors, so you can print out your own templates. Now, the best part about this is that it's on your iPad, so it's touchscreen, so you can pinch to zoom in and zoom out, and everything's touch, so all you have to do if you wanna do something, just touch it and it opens up and you can do it. And I think that is a whole lot of fun. So you can play with your embroidery designs on your iPad. Thanks everyone for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!